My name is Ernie Wicks, and this is the Bird Hug Creek Ranch. My name is Jordan Cole. Um, we operate a backgrounding operation here uh, east of Tisdale, and we run grass or cattle as well, and we have a feedlot here. That was the first quarter I bought, this one over here in 1961. So it's grown a little since then. Well, you know, this livestock thing was kind of my father's dream. That's where this kind of got started here. And this, this area, this country, just seemed like it's suited for it, more so than, than grain farming. Rebuilt the operation up here probably in the early 90s. Uh, before that, we were across the road and we felt this was a better location to expand our operation. Um, it was, at that time, we were a cow-calf operation and as time grew, we uh, started to build the feedlot up here. But as we got larger, we uh, needed to get authorization to go bigger. And this just kind of dovetail at the same time. Yeah, it was a fairly easy process. Um, and we knew what we wanted to do here, but following that process and having the funding help us out made, uh, made it possible. The holding pond, uh, we had a six to eight inch rain over a week period here about a month ago. And if you look over at the holding pond, it never went over. So it's doing the exact job it's supposed to do. Uh, the grass is growing in it. The weeds are, or the cattails are growing in it. The geese are on it. So I think it's, it's as healthy as it can get. No matter what in, side of the industry you're on, whether you're in the government side, uh, the agricultural side, the beef producing side, we need to look after our environment. We have one environment, or, and we, we need to do our due diligence. This is the headwaters for the Burnout Creek. This water from here actually flows in through, uh, through Arbor Field and some of these other areas. And it just seemed like the right thing to do. Operations are getting bigger and bigger, and I think we need to look after the environment. So we need to go through these process, and a lot of more people who don't think that they qualify or need this, they do need this and it's gonna get stricter guidelines as time goes. So you're better off to get on board now than when you have to later. You know, we have a vast land base here. Um, our population's growing all the time, but we have to look after it. Uh, we don't have a choice, because if not, it's not gonna be here tomorrow, or else we're gonna have stricter, stricter guidelines on what we have to do if we don't start looking after it now.